About a week ago, a group of ex-militants under the federal government's amnesty program stormed the gates of the government house in Asaba, the Delta state capital, in protest. Their grievance? An alleged attempt to discharge them from their current jobs of pipeline surveillance. It appears their action did not go down well with the state chapter of oil producing communities who have dissociated themselves from the protests. For them, the priority is different. The major concern of the OSCOM, therefore, is to ensure that the direct indigents of those communities housing these critical facilities, pipelines, are engaged directly instead of previous cases whereby persons were engaged from outside those communities being imported from where oil and gas is not producing. Apart from insisting that pipeline surveillance is solely the collective responsibility of host communities, the group also distances itself from politics. In our struggle, over the years, these persons that have come to protest, are they part of us? No. no. They are not. And we don't want the issue to be politicized. With Nigeria's heavy dependence on oil and its fluctuating global price, it is expected that all concerned parties will work together to maintain the peace.